Hey what's up guys, today I'm going to show you a new ROM for Redmi Note 3 device and the name of the ROM is AEX ROM and it's an USB extended ROM and it is based on Android 7.1.2 so first let me show you the about phone of this ROM so you can see guys it's an AEX ROM and it's the latest build I have installed right now and the model I'm using is Redmi Note 3 Kenzo and the end version is 7.1.2 and the ROM is pre-rooted for the root options just go to developer options and enable the root so why I choose this ROM because this ROM have similar customization options like resurrection remix and this ROM is stable too I have used all the uh, features of this ROM and everything is working fine so it have customization uh, like uh, resurrection remix but not more than resurrection remix so it's good ROM and the UI is based on pixel ROM and it's good so let me show you the settings of this ROM so you can see guys uh, right now I'm using the Volti that means the Volti is working fine in this uh, ROM and I'm using Geo 4G SIM and Bluetooth and Wi-Fi every network thing is working fine and there are there were no single network drop in this ROM so I've been using this ROM for 2 hours and everything works fine till now and you can see the extensions option here in this extensions option you can customize your ROM and you can see all the options here lock screen, recents, navigation, notification panel and status bar everything you can customize here so I have already did that and now you can see display option, to display and night light everything is there so these are the settings of the ROM and the memory backup of this ROM is really good I have right now 1.3 GB uh, remaining and uh, the battery backup is also real good uh, I installed this ROM at 50% and right now I have 47% battery left so these are the f uh, good things about this ROM and another good thing is that this ROM have zero bugs and Google now and G apps is also working fine with this ROM. There are no single force loops or boot loop in this ROM. So you can see the camera. Uh, I have touched all the features in the camera and everything is also working fine. I can click pictures, I can use front camera and I can record video too. So uh, right now I cannot st uh, start the recording because I am using screen recorder. So that's why I cannot record the video but it works fine don't worry. So guys, uh, that was it for this ROM and I have, if you want to install this ROM, I have given the link in the description for the files. You can download the ROM file and the gapps file from the link in the description. First install the ROM file, then install the gapps file and that's it. If you get into a boot loop, then just reboot your phone and it will work fine. So thank you guys, watch my video. If you like this video, subscribe my channel and watch my other videos too.